Hello everyone. Welcome to Thai Food Delight. Today we are making sweet sticky rice with longan and coconut milk. It's one of the desserts that I want to make it again and again because it's so simple and delicious. For this recipe, you will need very few ingredients to prepare. Today, I'm using 150 grams of fresh longan. We will cut these into half and remove the seeds. If you can't find fresh longan in your area, don't worry, you can still enjoy this Thai dessert by using canned longans. 200 milliliters of coconut milk. Salt for making sticky rice and sauce. 50 grams of sugar and 100 grams of sticky rice Before we can use our sticky rice, we need to prepare the sticky rice by wash and rinse it about 4 times to get rid of the starch One of the things that you need to be careful when cooking the sticky rice is that your sticky rice need to be fully cooked before adding the sugar. After 15 minutes, you can check if your sticky rice is fully cooked or not by squeezing it. If there's no white core, that means that your sticky rice is fully cooked. We will stir like this until the sugar dissolves. Making the sauce here is quite simple. You will need 200 milliliters of coconut milk and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Adding the salt here will help balancing the flavors. After the sauce simmers and starts to bubble up a bit, you can turn off the heat. Cooking the sauce this way can extend its shelf life. What I love about this Thai dessert is that you can either enjoy it warm or cold. If you like to serve this cold, you can put this in the fridge and the texture will become creamy like ice cream. Add a few tablespoons of coconut milk sauce on top and now it's time to serve. We hope you guys enjoy our Thai dessert and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. See you next time.